A pilgrimage to Nepal often includes a trip to Lumbini, the birthplace of Buddha. On the plains about five kilometers from India, it is one of the world's sacred places. Three hundred million Buddhists worldwide turn to Lumpini as Muslims pray to Mecca. In 1895, a German archaeologist and a Nepalese general discovered a massive stone pillar built by the Indian Emperor Ashoka, describing his visit to pay homage to the birthplace of Buddha. Almost a hundred years later, a Nepalese and Japanese archaeological team discovered the actual site by accident when they removed a tree from a crumbling temple ruin. When we do the excavation, actually we do the excavation with some aim. Now actually this is to discover the uh, marker stone was more or less uh, our luck or accidental. destruction unless you conserve it properly or publish it properly what you have done what you have achievement here now we have finished the excavation part now the conservation can be done at any day throughout the grounds you can wander through the temples built by Buddhist nations from around the world in dedication to this holy place work is still going on to build gardens and to excavate other sites. But nonetheless, time seems to stand still here. pilgrims can receive a blessing of their own in the quiet solitude of a temple. Everybody are welcome to pay the respect. The Buddha, he's a, one of the uh, extraordinary men and a human also. The sun sets on another age. Nepal, it's one of the poorest and yet one of the richest nations on earth.